What's up guys? I am back with another awesome Mafia City video. So here we are with a new massive update, Vigilante Training Room. That's a very big update guys. Right off the bat, if you are going to go in this and it's actually in the family club and if you are going to go in the Vigilante Training Room, it's a very big thing. You can see there is a lot of things going on. With this guys, the first impression that I am going to give you is that this is a very massive update. It's as massive as Renegades is going to change the game completely. The big thing that I notice in this is that they are trying to push health and damage stats a lot in this so i think in overall the damage and health stats are going to increase a lot so there will be higher boundary to it so that the top player can get more damage and health so in overall guys this is a another pay to win update for sure you need to spend a lot in order to complete this as fast as possible and that's what their goal is. but i will try my best to explain you everything i think i have understand everything in this update so i'm going to do my best to explain you all what the hell is vigilante training room now let's move on to the explanation part i'm going to keep it simple the first thing you need to do is to put some vigilante in the vigilante training room you can put total of five vigilante in this every vigilante can have five star in this make sure one thing is very important the star of the vigilante matters a lot what i'm going to call is this this center one is skill guys and these on the left and right one are the skill effect with this you can call this center one primary talent and the left and right one the secondary talent so if you want to get that bulker health the secondary talent first thing you need to do is to unlock the primary talent in order to unlock the primary talent you need to have some vigilante training manual either you can buy packs or another way you can get them is through street wars and daily project in street wars guys it's simple thing what you do every day if you do i don't really do a lot but you need to complete some street missions and then you are going to get six training manual from each mission guys it doesn't matter what level of that mission is purple blue whatever you're only going to get six training manual per mission i think somewhere near 100 vigilante training manual you're going to get from street wars now the another way that you can get those training manual is from daily project but for now guys i don't see any other way you can get this from daily project the section called talent is locked and other than that nothing is providing vigilante training manual i think the talent section is going to provide you vigilante training manual in daily project guys, you can accept six projects per day and i think the talent section is going to provide you vigilante training manual the total number of vigilante training manual you are going to get from daily project is still unknown because the talent section is still locked so i'm going to wait and i'm going to pin a comment in the comment section as soon as i get the information about this that how much you are going to get from talent section but for now there is only two ways that you can get this vigilante training manual from street wars and daily project so that's the baseline of this now let's talk about this primary and secondary skill of this there is a condition to unlock a primary skill you can see that it's writing training room assigned golden vigilante reach one out of five star so guys the star of your vigilante matters a lot how many star they have in them as you can see every section requires some star in order to unlock that primary talent as you can see if we are going to go on the second one you can see that it required three star in total to unlock this talent along with 200 vigilante training manual if we are going to go on the third one you can see that it required five star in order to unlock with 300 vigilante training manual so the star of your vigilante matters a lot so to max out all of these things all five of your vigilante in this training room should be five star as you can see we are going to go on the last talent or last skill of this you can see that it required 25 star in total to unlock along with 5000 vigilante training manual so guys as you move forward in this tree as you can see the first primary skill is going to take 100 vigilante training manual to unlock and the second one is going to take 200 vigilante training manual to unlock so this is just primary talent if you are going to talk about secondary talent it's going to cost even more as you can see this doesn't cost resources this cost vigilante training manual so i think the first section is going to be somewhere around 2000 vigilante training manual in total to max out completely and then as we move forward in each section the requirement for vigilante training manual is going to increase let's go on the last one guys as you can see that just to unlock the primary skill of this is going to require 
5000 vigilante training manual and we are going to talk about the secondary talent or secondary skill guys is going to cost even more as you go down in the street so overall guys with this it's show that this is a pay to win update and that's completely normal from them beginners guys or non spender low spender can start doing this investment but it's going to take a lot of time for them to move forward deep in this street but the spender one can buy a lot of packs and max out these sections a lot as you can see there are four section to this so in every section guys you can put vigilante and you can get stats bonus from this vigilante training room so each section you can put five vigilante in total for now only four boxes are unlocked if you are going to go on the last one it's saying that to unlock the slot all vigilante in the family club must have total star level of 120 so what i'm guessing from this star level is that these skill guys what you are getting this 10 skill the secondary skill guys the total number of point from this secondary skill should be 120 or more in order to unlock that last box so this is what i see from this and there are four sections so you can put four vigilante in every section guys and increase their stats once you put a vigilante in this guys there is another thing to this that there is a cooldown section to this and if i want to change this i need to wait 24 hours for this and it's different with each section guys and another thing to this is guys is that i cannot put one vigilante in two section suppose that in bulkar i already put james and if i am going to try to put james in my biker section i cannot put that because it is already in bulkar section so guys there is another thing to this is that you can see my total star of the vigilante is 5 suppose this that i have max out this three section in the vigilante training room you can see bulkar defensive park bulkar west bulkar offensive park so on the last one guys the star requirement to unlock this skill is going to be 5 star and if i change my vigilante and if it's less than 5 star guys i will not be able to get the bonus of the skill section even though i have already unlocked it it will be saved but i will not able to use because i am not completing the requirement to use that skill there should be total number of 5 star in this section if there is not that means that i cannot use this the total number of star from my vigilante should be 5 in order to use this skill so that's another thing if you are going to change your vigilante and the vigilante is less star than your previous one some skill might not work as you can see they have already mentioned this if you are going to go in the tip section in the third point they are writing if a gold vigilante in the slot causes the unlock talent to miss the required star condition the talent and support talent will become invalid and progress will be retained so progress will be retained if you are once you put back your old vigilante from which you unlock this section you can use that section from that vigilante if you change the vigilante and it doesn't me meet the star requirement of that skill section you will not be able to utilize that skill section that's what they are writing from this if you want to increase your shooter stat then i don't think that you need to use shooter prioritize vigilante in this although they recommend that you need to use shooter prioritize vigilante in order to increase the shooter skill but i don't think whatever vigilante you have max out you can just put that in whatever stats you want to increase suppose that you are a shooter player like me and you want to increase your shooter stat shooter health so the first thing what i'm going to do is to use my strongest vigilante in this so that i can get as much star as possible so in my case it's corner corner is four star in total then what i'm trying to do is that i will try to complete this primary talent and secondary talent i will try to complete this as much as possible it doesn't matter what kind of vigilante you are using all it's matter that how many star your vigilante have so make sure if you are trying to increase your shooter stats put your strongest vigilante in this and try to increase as much shooter stats as possible same with biker player whatever strongest vigilante you have put this in the vigilante training room in biker section and try to complete this primary and secondary skill with this guys one more thing is that you need to have a lot more five star vigilante in order to complete all of this section suppose that you are a shooter player then you need to put your strongest vigilante in the shooter section and start to complete this so guys with this one thing is clear that if you are a shooter player make sure that you have your strongest vigilante in that shooter section that was the final thing about this vigilante training room so this is a pretty complex update from what i will say my first impression is going to be that is going to require 
a lot of vigilante training manual to max this out a lot of guys it's just beginning you are seeing that 101 if you are going to move forward in this is going to require even more and from what i see that you are going to get like somewhere near 100 from street wars and probably 50 from the your daily project so that's the vigilante training room update guys i hope i explain everything if i miss something let me know in the comment section below as usual i'm going to pin a comment which is going to tell you how much vigilante training manual you are going to get from daily project that was it guys a pay to win update i was just thinking for a long time that they are going to be doing something different with vigilante as they have already done with renegade and there it is a huge update they have released in order to make vigilante more stronger and the game have become more complex you need to use more of your mind in order to understand this game completely so that was the video guys if you enjoy this if you have any kind of question about this let me know in the comment section below and if i miss something also let me know in the comment section below that's it for the video now i'll see you in another one until then take care stay safe and peace